So what I did was here, uh, I borrowed a Kia e Nero uh, from one of the dealerships or stealerships, if you so please. Um, <clears throat> sorry about that. I borrowed that one. Uh, I drove it uh, 222.9, so 223 kilometers from uh, Östersund to Åre. Uh, or is a ski resort in the north of Sweden and then back again so uh, it was an, an ABBA test ABA from point A to point B to point A again uh, with me in the car I had my wife and my two children and our dog so it was pretty heavy weight-wise, but it's still, uh, as you can see from the pictures, I messed up the recording, so there's just going to be a few pictures uh, from that session. Uh, it was 18.3 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers, or 183 watt hours per kilometer. Uh, that is very uh, very uh, impressive, especially since it was minus. It was uh, it was between minus two and minus six or seven degrees the whole time. Uh, the roads were mostly clean. Uh, tried to keep it uh, to the speed limit all the time, just to see how efficiently you really can drive it if you if you keep with the uh, speed limits. Uh, charged it, uh, well I started at 96% as you can see, uh, drove it down to 66% uh, when I arrived, so that was a 30% state of charge uh, used, uh, plugged it into a 11 kilowatt charger, it actually gave a 12 according to the uh, readout on the B charger so I guess it was a 22 kilowatt charger uh, so I guess the app was incorrect anyhow um, charge it for I don't know an hour approximately uh, got back to 82 percent drove back I spent what is that 25 percent down to 56 percent state of charge so all in all 55% states of charge to drive 230 kilometers. Uh, so that would take me, I don't know, 300, 350 kilometers in these conditions, which I find very good, uh, especially considering the load. Uh, not that I want to call my wife heavy, but yeah, you know, you get my drift. So yeah, uh, there's going to follow a short clip uh, of my return of the car uh, this morning. So, uh, cheers! So I've been driving the uh, Kia e Nero this past weekend. Um, haven't had the time to do any videos on this one, but uh, I drove, uh, yesterday I drove 222.3 kilometers minus 8 degrees from Östersund or just outside of Östersund in the north of Sweden to the ski resort Åre. Uh, back and forth it used 18.9 I think it was kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers or 189 per kilometer. Um, I will add some photos this video now I'm gonna just go back and give it back to the uh, dealership <laughs> dealership uh, today it's slightly colder well it's a hell of a lot colder actually uh, it was not minus eight yesterday it was minus two two minus seven uh, and it was only minus seven for the last 30 or 40 kilometers so it was mostly around minus two minus three degrees 
yesterday uh, and today it's indicating minus 14 I think it's gonna be dropping more because my temperature sensor at home said minus 19 so we'll see um, so this one is a uh, Kia e-Niro Advance Plus bump it up to the correct speed this is an 80 zone so I'm gonna be doing 83 I think that will be about 80 uh, actual GPS speed what I like about this one is both heated seat ventilated seats steering wheel heater driver only I think that's gonna save some energy in this cold freaking weather it's very much winter here Swedish or Nya Eniro. Around this town, Östersund, there are some stations where you can charge the car for free. So I just got to get a new coffee maker, so I'll charge it for a few minutes just to show you. So here you can see these free station, free stations are scattered all over Östersund. They give. 11 kilowatt hours or yeah a bit more but this one is topping out the 11 uh, I'm gonna double check it might be a 22 but it's only getting 11 I'll check that 